Good morning, peeps. I always love these. Look at this. Goodie box. Woohoo. Yes, I don't know what number this is. I'm so excited to get another one. I've been very diligent about answering all of the questions this time. <laughs> One time I didn't, if you ever get a goodie box, make sure you go and answer all of the um, questions that they ask you about it, you know, what you think about it, because they won't send you another one until you do. And I almost didn't get one because of that, but uh -huh. I got one this time. I was very good about it last time. Anyway, so daily goodie box. It says, you got a goodie box. Please enjoy all the free samples and full-size products. Remember to log into your account and share your thoughts. And I will do that. I will make sure and do that. Oh, look at that. Food right on top. Ooh, I love the food. Oh, man. I think we just did this at a taste test with my la brother and sister and spousal unit and boy toy. Ah, what the heck. We'll try it anyway. I don't... I don't think we cared for them. This is a different. I know there's a lot of people that really like these, but I don't think I really cared for them. Now this, maybe this is just a different brand because it smells better. Look at that. It smells better. This is a Parmesan one. Oh, this is definitely not as bad as the last one I had. I don't remember what it was, but it was, the last one was not good. We have a Nero gum energy and focus powder with natural caffeine balanced with L, E and I infused with B vitamin. Interesting. Oh. Look at that. It is gum. <clears throat> wow. I wonder what they get natural caffeine from. This is, this is an orange box with yellow writing that I cannot read. Maybe you can read that. I guess I need to get a... Um, what do you call them things? I don't even know. I need something to read that. Because I definitely can't read what's in it. Oh, there's fake sugar in it. Me and fake sugar are not friends. So. This I will pass along to somebody else to test. I don't know how good it's going to be. Oh, yes. Oh, sorry. Um, the good bean sea salt chickpeas. I was going to see if it's anything. Chickpeas, garbanzo beans. You know what they are, right? It sounds yummy. Can you see them in there? Little baby chickpeas. Crunchy chickpeas, four grams of protein. Whole beans. Now you young people probably aren't gonna understand this, but when we get older, I don't know, my taste buds aren't as good as they used to be, so they kind of taste bland to me. They aren't bad, they're just kind of bland. Is anybody else out there like them? Now this is exciting because I use this a lot. <coughs> Look at this. 
nutritional yeast. Um, if you are plant-based, on a plant-based diet, one of the things you have to be very careful about is your B vitamin. Sorry, I had to get that chickpea out of there. Um, and this is a very good way to get it, is nutritional yeast. Now, when we're outside at the campfire and watching TV, because the brother has mounted his TV on the chicken coop and it's he just pulls it out and we sit out there and watch TV and <laughs> the fire. It's awesome. But he'll make us um, popcorn like my mother used to make, which had nutritional yeast on it. And I actually like that. I have enough nutritional yeast, but I think I'll pass this on to him to put on the popcorn because I like nutritional yeast. This stuff is off awesome. Now I have to warn you, you have to learn how to eat it and how to deal with it because it's not, it's not like something you can eat out of the package. This is, you put it in something or on something, but if you know anything about nutritional yeast, that stuff is great. And I use that a lot, so that's gonna be awesome. Um, we have some fresh and strong alcohol-free vegan natural Australian river mint natural mouthwash. Huh. I'll try it. Spousal unit's more into mouthwash than I am, so he'll probably be trying it more than I will, but I'll try it at least once. Sorry, I still have chickpea in my mouth. It's stuck there. Um, immune support shot, fruit and veggie, vitamin A, C, D, B, and B12, made with organic fruits and vegetables, feel good superfood. This must be like one of those shots you take in the morning to get all your vitamins. Do not exceed suggested use. Or if you're pregnant, nursing, or taking medication, consult your doctor. Well, that leaves spousal unit out. Take one shot a day in to support your immune system, and it has a whole list of organic stuff in it. I have to look to see what kind of um, sweetener. Um, they're using stevia. Stevia does not give me a headache, but I don't care for the taste of it, but it is something I can try. So I will probably try that. Oh yes. Nice. I've never heard of these. This is awesome. Now I've gotten suckers from these guys before and they were very good. This is not a low-calorie food. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. This is PB cups, milk chocolate style peanut butter cups. The after you eat treat, treat for a healthy smile. How's that going to help a smile? Interesting. This product, oh, allergy information. Sugar, well, that makes me nervous. Sugar-free milk chocolate. which probably doesn't, um, yeah, it's got a calcium caseinate. There's some things in here that I'm not overly fond of, <clears throat> but we're gonna try one just because. Snap, I can't get it open. That's why I have scissors. It's one of the things I really miss about Jennifer. If I don't like it, I can pawn it off at her and she'll eat it because she eats anything. I miss you, Jennifer. Oh good, these are all individually packaged. PB cups. Now, I love Reese's peanut butter cups, so we'll see how they taste in comparison. Sugar-free always makes me nervous. I 
doesn't look bad. I'm, I'm a bit surprised. Does not have that sugar-free taste. I don't know how they pulled that off. It's not bad. The true test is if I get a headache from it. Which does happen to me when I eat fake sugar. Does it do that to anybody else out there or is it just me? Ooh, shea butter. I got a bar of soap. Shea butter. South of France, natural body care. French milled bar soap with organic shea butter. It smells really good. That was the last thing in here, peeps. They sent 25% off of your Feel Good Superfoods if you wanted to buy this um, shots. And then they sent information on the Zolly candy, which is the peanut butter cups, or the PB cups. It's PB cups. Remember that. PB cups. Which actually tastes better than I thought it was going to. Which is surprising. I don't know why, but it is. So, they aren't bad. I like this. There was a lot of food in this one. I'm a foodie. Okay, like last time, I did keep two things that I wanted to show you that I did have an appreciation for. Maybe I shouldn't have stuck that whole thing in my mouth so I could actually tell you about it. This is the last. I got this in the last box. Um... Spousal unit has a deeper pain, so he said it didn't really help with that. However, when I got burned, I put it on it, and that really helped. I don't know that it's supposed to be for burns, but it really helped the burns, so I'm going to say I really liked it for that. The other thing that I really liked, of course, <laughs> are you surprised? These were good. I like them a lot. And you should just know that. Anyway, so all of these, if you don't know about the um, Daily Goodie Box, they are on Facebook and they have a website and stuff. And you can go and fill out questionnaires and stuff. And if you get chosen, you get a goodie box. Once you get chosen, if you keep answering their surveys and stuff, They'll keep sending them to you. If you don't answer the surveys, you won't. And I found that out on my very own. <laughs> so um, if you're interested, the links are below for all of them. Um, the links for all of these products are down below. Like I said, if you are plant-based or trying to be, you should incorporate this in your diet. It's very good for vitamin B, most um, plant-based, or maybe the term you're more used to, vegan, tend to get lacking in their vitamin B. So you either need to take a vitamin B or use something like nutritional yeast. I'm not a vitamin taker. Not good at that. I, I don't do well taking pills of any kind, so... I would rather dump this on my popcorn or in some food or something. So for you plant-based vegan kind of people, that's a good plan to have some of that. Um, the Zollies was much better than I had anticipated. It says it's totally sugar-free, so I don't know what they're using. Um... I have a very hard time with sugar-free stuff like, well, stevia, I can, I can, um, 
eat and it doesn't give me a headache I just don't like the aftertaste now this does not have an aftertaste so whatever they're using is pretty good and we're gonna find out if it gives me a headache and maybe next time I'll tell you whether I live through it or not but it tastes good for a sugar-free I'm telling you I'm surprised um, these again I, my taste buds are not as good as they used to be and they're just kind of bland uh, the texture is good I think that if they were a little more maybe salty I would like them these weren't too bad they were much better than the last ones I had that were similar the cheese crispy things I'll end up eating the whole little packet because they were pretty good I can't say that I would go out and buy them because um, me and dairy are not friends. Doesn't mean I don't like it. It just means I can't eat it without being sorry later. So that was it. My daily goodie box. Remember the links are all in the description. Please go and check all of them out or some of them or go and sign up with um, that da the daily goodie box and try to get a box because they're great fun. They really are. Um, I hope this finds you all absolutely flamazing. Are you flamazing? I need to know. Inquiring minds need to know. I've lost my remote again. Dang, gum. Um, <clears throat> and I hope you stay blessed. And until next time. Hey, you made it to the end. Please hit like and subscribe and thanks for watching.